I have bought a new set of knives for the kitchen and I thought I would open the box and let you see what's in and share the first impressions here. So this is from the brand Fasaka and they're sold on Amazon. I will put the link below in the description. So if you're curious about it, you can look at that to get price information. And let's see, I've bought other items from this company and I've been happy with what I got from them. So they, um, they always have a card in with their contact information. And so that's the box with the knives in it. And this must be, there's a base that comes with it too. This must be the base. So we'll look at this one first. And so that's the card again. The base has a good weight to it, so it shouldn't fall over on the counter. And it has a stainless outer cover, but the bottom is plastic. And it looks like the inside dividers are plastic as well. But this has room for several different knives in it or of different sizes too. It's not preset slots. It's just one long slot all the way across. And then the larger one that probably will be where I put the scissors. So let me move this where you can see it better. So the set of knives themselves come with a pair of kitchen shears. And then there were five knives. And let's see what we have here. The knife has a good weight to it. It's not a lightweight plastic knife. And I'm looking at the blade on it. It looks it looks pretty pretty sharp. So you're gonna wanna be careful with these whenever you first get them. The, um, the tip, I appreciate that that's been covered, at least in shipping. And then that would just rest inside the case there. And this must be the paring knife. Again, that's, it's larger than most paring knives that I've had, but it is a size that I would use a lot in the kitchen. And this is a bread knife, I believe. I'll have to go back and look at the description to see what each of the types of knives are, but it's a longer serrated knife, so it would work as a bread knife. I feel a little bit nervous because the blades look so sharp. I don't want to cut myself. And this one is very sharp at the tip too. A little more than the others seem to be. And then here's a larger kitchen knife here. say if you get these be very careful opening them because I don't want anyone to cut themselves on the blades as they're taking off the protective ends here so you can see the knives fit easily inside here and you can you could adjust them whatever however you're going to use them and want to have it there but that works well and I'll give you a better view of that in a minute but the shears I was the most intrigued by because the kitchen shears that I've had in the past are just a pair of scissors and these have a, a good feel to them. The, um, let's see, I wonder if they'll work both ways. They feel like they would work with left and right. The, um, the scissors themselves feel like they have a good connection so that they would cut well. But if you notice here, it has a bottle opener here. It has a grip here for opening bottles, I guess, or maybe a nutcracker there. I'm not sure what you would use that for. The end has a tapered edge where you could use that as a screwdriver or I don't know what else you would use it for. But this is the part that I thought was the most helpful. All of the scissors that I have that I've used in the past stay together. And so you end up getting things in between that can make it um, deteriorate quickly. These come apart so that you can wash them completely, sterilize them, and then put them back together. 
So I don't know if you could see how I did that. Is There's a little slot inside this one that fits over the groove on this one. So that way they work well together, but you can take them apart if you want to sharpen them or for washing them. And then they fit inside this part of the, the stand. So that's the Fasaka knife set. I will um, use these in some future videos showing you how to cut them. My biggest test I want to use them on is cutting tomato. And maybe I'll try that before I post this and give you a little preview of the, the other videos. Thanks for watching and um, check below if you are interested in checking out the site on Amazon.